Saul Canelo Alvarez versus Julio Cesar Chavez Jr. T-Mobile Arena, Las Vegas, Nevada, May 6th. Let me know who you're taking for this fight. Chavez Jr. needs a knockout to win this fight. Saul Canelo Alvarez is the superstar in this situation. If the fight's close and it goes the distance, the judges are going to give it to Canelo. At some point in this fight, Chavez Jr. is going to have to go for broke and go for the knockout on Canelo. When that happens, this fight is going to be an absolute war. Chavez Jr. is going to keep the fight at a distance for the first couple rounds, using his height and reach on Canelo. But eventually, Canelo will cut the ring off. And the two will battle it out, toe to toe. It's going to be a back and forth kind of fight. There's going to be a lot of exchanges. Canelo's speed and combinations will shine in the judge's eyes. But when Chavez Jr. gets Canelo on the ropes, he's going to look good as well. Chavez will try to bully Canelo on the ropes with his size and strength. And by the end of this fight, Canelo will look gassed. And although both guys have awesome power, I don't see this fight ending in a knockout. At the end of this fight, there's going to be people who think Chavez won, and there's going to be people who think Canelo won. But obviously, if it's close and it goes the distance, the judges will favor Canelo. If this fight goes as close as I think it will, a rematch will be warranted. And that's just the excuse that Canelo's team might have to delay the Golovkin fight. But who knows, Chavez's size may play a bigger factor than we all think. He might be able to finish Canelo. But Chavez Jr. is a wild card himself. This is a guy who in the past hasn't taken fights very seriously. He misses weight. He doesn't train properly. If he doesn't train properly or cut the weight properly, Canelo could have his way with Chavez Jr. early and get a highlight reel knockout. But since both fighters come from the same origin of Mexico, Pride is on the line. The pride of Mexico is at stake in this fight. Which is why this fight is going to be an absolute treat for boxing fans. I'm taking Canelo to win by 12 round decision in an absolute war on May 6th. Real Boxing 100, out.